Hello from Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. My name is Gray Alton, and I'm the Vice President of Project Development for Terrapin. I want to thank RISE for allowing us to present our innovative heat to value solutions today. Terrapin was founded in 2016 to help our clients solve these problems. They were facing the retirement of coal facilities, the introduction of carbon pricing, and increasingly stringent emission standards, and their facilities were wasting a lot of heat every year. They were also asking the questions of how can they comply with these emission standards and the pricing associated with co complying. And with the 2040, 2045, and 2050 carbon neutral commitments, how can our clients best deliver a great sustainability story to their stakeholders? And lastly, how can they comply with everything above while reducing their carbon footprint and still staying profitable as a business? Terrapin believes that we have the heat and power solutions that can help lead them through this transition. Terrapin has three verticals, industrial waste heat to power, industrial direct heat use, and geothermal. Geothermal also is power and direct heat use. With waste heat to power, Terrapin is able to source waste heat resources and develop behind the fence power generation opportunities or the power can be sold to the grid. The same with the direct heat use for that waste heat that can't generate power. Terrapin can look for uh, options to offset natural gas use within the facility or sell it within a five to seven kilometer radius over the fence. And lastly, geothermal is the same principles and technologies as industrial waste heat to power and direct heat use. The only difference is that we use the earth to, to heat the brine and it is a renewable process. But all three Terrapin verticals generate emission-free baseload heat and power. How does it work? You hire Terrapin to do a waste heat mapping study where we can investigate your industrial facility, a geothermal formation, or an oil field that can lead to a client funded project or a client funded project through a consortium or Terrapin can bring the third party capital to fund the project. Either way, it all leads to the site and the technology construction with a qualified engineering procurement and construction partner. And that project, all Terrapin projects lead to revenue. That revenue can be through the sale of power and heat or the deferred purchase from the grid of that power and heat. There's also value in the carbon offsets that are generated from Terrapin projects and the environmental social governance story. Whether client led or Terrapin led, Terrapin is able to develop end to end turnkey heat to value projects or Terrapin is able to, to participate in any portion of this process that you see on the screen here. As a vertically integrated developer, we also need to bring a lot of diverse services to the table to help support our clients. Terrapin has a lot of experience uh, with private and public entities doing uh, a lot of different consulting, as you can see on the screen here. Terrapin uses Organic Rankin Cycle, or ORC, to convert waste heat to power. And we have an exclusive distribution agreement with Exergy, a world-class uh, ORC designer and manufacturer. A few key points here are that this is a, uh, an example of how an ORC facility could look like, but it, this isn't a typical deployment. ORCs are very flexible and we can deploy it depending on how much plot space is available. There's also no water required within our process. Uh, which can mean that we can work with a lot of remote sites and we're efficient at a variety of operating temperatures within a lot of different industries. Direct heat use, it's the same principles as waste heat to power when we capture the waste heat, but instead we put it into a network that we can either offset natural gas within the facility or within uh, neighboring facilities five to seven kilometers away. Uh, this is not a cascade use as you can see the arrows. This is just a full example of how many opportunities there are for direct heat use. Terrapin has gained a lot of traction in North America. We have a geothermal project in development in Northern Alberta, and we have over 50 megawatts of waste heat to power projects and a healthy tier two pipeline of projects in development. Um, we also are gaining global growth um, in pulp and paper, geothermal, utilities, uh, oil and gas, agriculture, food production, and heavy manufacturing like parts, paper, um, and steel and glass. Terrapin has a proven and specialized team um, that have developed projects around the globe. And we have a great support network that, we, that we're super proud to work with. Our ask today 
is that you will be the first in Southeast Asia to hire Terrapin for a facility heat mapping study so we can find an innovative heat to value project. Thank you, and I look forward to engaging with you further.